That's a replica. No, it's nothing of the sort. This painting kept me going. It's the reason I made it this far. Sensei, don't tell me. It's fake. Yes, a counterfeit. I heard there was a counterfeit spreading around, so I bought it. So you're telling me the actual artist behind the painting bought a counterfeit? That's pushing it. You're lying, Sensei. Please, just tell us the truth. You too? I've reported you to my private security company. What? I had it set up to deal with some problematic paparazzi, but I never thought it'd come in so handy. Please, wait. Let's talk about this. You can talk all you want to the police. That includes you, Yusuke. Lady On, let's run! A cat? Where did it... There's no point. They'll be here within two minutes. Takamaki-san! Yeah, let's go! those two managed to get away. I don't recall ever seeing this cat costume before, though. What is this place? We are inside Matarame's heart. Inside Sensei's heart? I'm sorry, Takamaki-san, but are you sure you're feeling okay? She ain't lying. This is what that bastard truly feels. He's nothing but a greed-filled money grub. Enough of this rubbish! Kitagawa-kun, didn't it cross your mind that something wasn't... <sighs> That's... Uh... You may not want to believe it, but this is another reality as viewed through Matarame's eyes. This is his true nature. 
this repulsive world? Just who are all of you? I guess you could say we're a group that changes the hearts of rotten crooks. If everything you say is true, then the sensei I know doesn't exist. You gotta snap out of it. Still, he has kept me safe these past ten years. My gratitude for that won't just disappear. You're gonna forgive him? At this rate, you'll... Are you okay? I'm trying to be rational about this, but my emotions are overwhelming me. Sorry, but we don't have time to dawdle. The security level's gone through the roof. We need to get out of here at once! No, it's all right. Yes! Could this be? Not only does it have an overwhelmingly tangible presence, it bears a charm that draws everyone to it. There's a certain shifting to it that other pieces do not possess. So you can gain the world. <clears throat> clothes. First a king, now some kind of shogun. Welcome to the museum of the master artist, Madarame. Huh? Sensei? Is that you? That attire? Disgusting. This... this is all one big lie, isn't it? My usual ragged attire is nothing but an act. Besides a famous person living in that shack, I have another home. Under a mistress's name, of course. Sayuri was stolen, why was it in the storage room? And if you had the real one, why make copies? If it's really you, Sensei, please tell me. Foolish child, you still don't see? The painting being stolen was just a false rumor I spread. It was all a perfectly calculated staging. What do you mean? How does this sound? I found the real painting, but it can't go public. You can have it for a special price, though. Haha! <laughs> How's that for preferential treatment? Art sobs will eat it up and pay good cash at that! No. The 
worth of art is purely subjective. Thus, this is a legitimate business transaction. Though I doubt a brat like you would ever come up with such a brilliant scheme. You keep going on and on about money this, money that. No wonder you ended up with this disgusting museum. You're supposed to be an artist, right? Aren't you ashamed of plagiarizing other people's work? Art is nothing but a tool. A tool to gain money and fame! You help me greatly as well, Yusuke. God, it pisses me off. That's your teacher. But what about the people who believe in you? Who think you're a master artist? I'll tell you this alone, Yusuke. If you wish to succeed in this world, I'd advise you don't rise against me. Do you believe anyone could find success with my objection holding them down? <laughs> to think I was under the care of this wretched man. You thought I took you in out of the goodness in my heart? Plucking talented yet troubled artists allows me to find promising pupils and take their ideas. After all, it's much easier to steal the futures of children who can't fight back. I can't believe this. Livestock are killed for their hide and meat. This is no different, you fool. But I tire of this little chat. It's time that I... You are unforgivable. Mm. It doesn't matter who you are. I won't forgive you! So, you repay my keeping you around for all these years with ingratitude? You damn brat! Men, dispose of these thieves! Get back! How amusing. Huh? <laughs> it seems the truth is stranger than fiction, huh? Kitagawa-kun? I wanted to believe it wasn't true. I had clouded my vision for so long. My eyes were truly blind. Blind and unable to see the true self behind this one horrible man. Have you finally come to your senses? <laughs> How foolishly you averted your eyes for the truth. A deplorable imitation indeed. Best you part from that aspect of yourself. Let us now forge a contract. <laughs> I am thou, thou art I. The world is filled with both beauty and vice. It is time you teach people which is the which. Very well. Come. Go him on! A breathtaking sight. Imitations they may be, but together they make a fine spectacle. Though the flowers of evil blossom, be it known, abominations are fated to perish! Whoa, this is impressive! <laughs> Who do you think you are? The price for your insolence will be death! Where are my guards? Kill them all! The children who adored you as father. The prospects of your pupils. How many did you trample upon? How many dreams did you exchange for riches? No matter what it takes, I will bring you to justice! I am ready!
presence of Lord Marwame! On your knees, intruders! I learned much from you, Madarame. In order to see authenticity, one must be dispassionately realistic. With Goemon by my side, I can now ascertain your true self without any reservations. I am thou. Goemon, strike! Yeah, he's Regina. so funny. Ravage now! No. I don't see a weakness. Persona! Go down! Joker's dizzy! Persona! His accuracy is going to be worse now! Yeah. Yeah. Persona! Persona! Take this! Persona! Ravage them! Come on, Joker! <laughs> Get now I'm even more charming. future down the drain. I'll destroy every chance you've ever had of becoming an artist. Matarame. You'll forever rue the day you dared defy me. Get back here. Kitagawa-kun! Why can't I move? Listen, you're totally drained. You can't do much even if you wanted to. What a disgrace I am. Come on, just listen to her. You've known for quite some time, haven't you? I'm no fool. Strange people have been coming by for years. And the plagiarism was an everyday affair. But... Who would want to admit that the man they owed their life to was doing such terrible things? Why didn't you leave, Kitagawa-kun? Well, he is the one who painted the Sayuri. On top of that, I owe him a great debt. You mean because he raised you? I never knew my father. I was told my mother raised me by herself, but... She died in an accident when I was three. That's when Sensei took me in. I heard he helped my mother while she was still alive. Heard? To be honest, I don't remember much about my mother either. I did everything I could for Sensei. I thought of him as a father. But he changed. To think he would treat the Sayori, the very foundation of his art, like that. A lot's happened to you, huh? When you had mentioned plagiarism, deep down, I knew you were right. That's why I so vehemently denied you. I was simply running from the truth. I'm sorry. grateful for the chance to face what I've been denying all this time. You're way too serious, man. That's why you're always getting stuck in your own head. Look at me. I just go with the flow. For real. What are you going to do now? I don't know. We can't help the fact that Madarame's gone and changed. But, we can change his heart. 
We'll make him pay for his crimes. That reminds me. You mentioned something about that change of heart earlier. Have you heard the rumors? The ones about the phantom thieves that steal hearts? <laughs> Don't tell me. Oh, crap! We'll talk later. We need to scram! When did my clothes change? You just noticed that now? Save it for after. Let's go! I see. And because of that, this PE teacher's had a change of heart. Phantom thieves who steal hearts. To think they truly exist. No, I believe you. There's no need for common sense to blind me after seeing a world like that. So, your plan with Madarame, Sensei? With Madarame, is to force a change of heart, correct? Let me join, as a member of the Phantom Thieves. Had I faced reality sooner, this may have been avoided. I must put an end to this, for the sake of the others whose futures as artists were robbed as well. That is the most civil thing I can do for the man who was, in some manner, my father. Civil, huh? Sounds fine to me. We're not gonna deal with Madarame anyways. He may have a mental shutdown if we screw up. We have ways to prevent that, but they aren't fail-safe. Remember how we mentioned this on our way here? Madarame is a man who has the art world under his thumb. He has connections to many organizations. If someone like me raises my voice, it'll only be snubbed out. We have no option but this. Kitagawa-kun. It's a deal, then. We have a new member in the Phantom Thieves now. I hope we get along, Yusuke. You better not slow us down. I'll do my best. Uh, so that was all a plan. Well, that's quite daring, Takamaki-san. It wasn't my idea, it was theirs! What else were we supposed to do? It's his fault for going on and on about the nude modeling thing. I haven't given up on that yet, though. Give it up! Oh, that reminds me. I wonder what's going on with the real Madarame. Yusuke and I were in a pretty tight situation. Actually, I contacted him before we came here. He believes that I continued pursuing Takamaki-san. And, just as you all explained, it appears he knows nothing about his shadow. What did he say? He was complaining to the security company how they couldn't even catch one high school girl. However, he's still furious about it and said that he's going to take legal action against everyone. Talk about being completely on guard. Legal action? He's acting way too desperate. Maybe he still has more secrets. If he were to act, it'd be after the exhibit is over. Any scandal during the show would be his loss. Talk about being a nude model is over. This happens? We'll have to force a change of heart before then if we're to dodge this legal action thing. Looks like our plan must be accomplished while the exhibit is still open. By the way, what is this? Huh? A cat. But it's talking. You have a problem with that? No, not really. Why not? 
He's just on a different wavelength than other people. Do you wish to draw me? You better bring out the best of me in that case. Hmm. Hey, don't touch me like... I was thinking of ordering some black bean jelly. I bet he got that idea from a black cat. Oh! I didn't bring any money. Never mind. He's just weird. Hey. No, no, no. something. 